Hey guys, it's Kate and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a back to school um, first day kind of makeup look. This is how the look turned out, so if you're interested in finding out how I uh, achieved this makeup look, just keep on watching. And if you watch to the end, I'm going to be telling you guys how you can enter to win a MacBook. So make sure you watch to the end, or you can just skip to the end if you're not interested in the makeup tutorial. So yeah, make sure you watch to the end, and I'll get on with this video. So you might have noticed that I already have my foundation on, that is only because I'm using my viewfinder for this makeup tutorial and I, I think it would be absolutely impossible to get an even coverage using the viewfinder so I just went ahead and put only the foundation on first. I'll show you what I used. I used a pea size amount of my Rimmel Lasting Finish 25 Hour Foundation um, in 200 Soft Beige and I mixed a pea size amount of the Infallible Pearl Matte Foundation in Golden Beige and I just used a beauty blender to blend these into my face. And if you were wondering, I did use a pore filler primer by NYX and that's what it looks like. And to prep my skin, I did use a Clinique moisturizer. It is the dramatically different moisturizing gel for oily skin, I believe, and this is what that looks like as well. Sorry for the lines, um, I can't really help that, but the thing I use after foundation is some concealer. Now I'm going to be using the Revlon Color Stay Concealer in the color Light Medium, so I just use my fingers to blend that in. I just put a little bit under my eyes. on and off about 30 times and they will not go away now once I'm done my base makeup which is my concealer and foundation I'm just taking my Rimmel uh, stay matte powder and translucent and I'm applying it under my eyes and all over my face to just set the makeup Fine hustlers, skin tight jeans, got a choice, education, living on the street. I don't know where I belong, but I'm getting there on my own. Uh -oh. So the thing I do after my powder is usually my eyebrows, so I'm probably going to zoom in for this. Um, my eyebrows probably take the most out of my makeup routine. I, it's my favorite part, but it takes super, super long because my eyebrows are literally non-existent and I like to have them really full, kind of like Kylie Jenner. I'm just using the Gorgeous Cosmetics palette and I'm using the brown shade. I'm just going to get started on my brows now. This brow is pretty much um, done. I might fix it up a little bit more, but I'm going to come back when the other brow is finished. The next thing I'm going to be showing you in this tutorial is my mascara. And the mascara that I use is the Love Alpha Mascara. So I'm just applying my mascara like a normal person. I don't know. God, I really hate my 9 to 5. Sick of work until my body hurts. Sick of work until my body hurts. So the next thing 
that I'm going to be doing is eyeshadow and I'm going to be using the Naked One palette and obviously it just looks like this. I hate the packaging, everything sticks to it. But I'm going to be using the color Sin and Sidecar. I know I already applied my mascara, I completely forgot to put my eyeshadow on but my eyeshadow routine is kind of like super simple. Oh yeah, and I also use the color Virgin for a highlight. And the first thing that I do is just apply Sin all over my lid. I don't put a lot of eyeshadow on because I just like it more natural looking. And then I'm applying the more dark kind of shimmery shade called Sidecar in my crease and just blending it. And now for the color Virgin, I'm just putting a little bit of that into the middle of the lid as like a lid highlight bam, dimension. Now it's time for one of my favorite parts and it is contouring. I love to build up a light contour and the palette I'm going to be using is, I'm not sure which palette it is, I completely forget, but it has all these shades. So I'm basically going to be using this color for my contour. And I'm also going to be using my Coastal Scents Blush and Bronzer Mini Palette. It has these five colors and I'm going to be using this one. So I use that shade just under my eyes. Just for a little bit of shimmer, it's not too shimmery, it's basically just skin color. So now I'm going to get on with contouring and the first thing that I do is grab my darkest contour shade. I take a little bit onto my contour brush from Real Techniques. I feel like since I'm filming you can't really see it and I should probably make it a little bit darker than it usually is, you know? Funny story, I actually bought this recently and the minute I walked out the store, I dropped the bag. I kid you not, I screamed inside of the mall and the highlighter was smashed. I don't think I ever like was so disappointed in my life. And I just used some highlighter, highlighter right here. For some reason, I do circular motions with my fan brush. Not a lot of people do that, but I do. I'm just going to be using my Naked Palette brush and I'm putting a highlighter under my brow because I think it makes you look so glowy. So now we can get onto the lip and I use two products for my lip. The first product I use is a drugstore product called Styly Style and it is a line in seal lip. Don't know what that means but it's basically just a color like this. And for over top of that, I use the Revlon Ultra HD Matte Lip Color. I believe it is in the color Seduction. I hope you guys like this tutorial. I tried to make something that would go with pretty much every skin tone. I feel like the colors would go with neutral, cool, and warmer tones. Now to get on to the most exciting part of the video, I'm going to be talking about the giveaway that I'm going to be doing and I'm partnering up with Bath Bomb Boxes to host this for you guys. So Bath Bomb Boxes is going to be giving away a MacBook 
to my subscribers. So basically all you have to do to enter this giveaway is to subscribe to my channel, like this video, and use the code in the description at the Bath Bomb Boxes website. So on the website, there are tons of things to choose from. They have five bath bombs for $16, and that is such a crazy deal because if you went to Lush, Lush has bath bombs for $15 to even $20 for one bath bomb. Lush is crazy expensive. These are basically the same bath bombs, but better for a much cheaper price. So once the code is used 1,000 times, one of those people will get a MacBook. So if you are interested in entering this contest, like I said, subscribe to my channel, make sure you like this video, and use that code. You can enter unlimited amounts of times, so if you use the code like 12 times, you're entered like 12 times. I just wanted to thank you for staying till the end, and I hope you have a great back to school season. I'm not sure if you are back to school yet. I'm sure there are places around the world that are already back to school, but for me, in two to three weeks, we are going back to school, and I'm not excited, but this is probably the look I'm going to wear going back to school. Make sure to give that like button a hit, and make sure you subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, hugs and kisses, and I'll see you next time.